Hello and welcome to Dr. Mako's Advanced Medical Guide. Before we start, please have your trainer or partner with you in game. For this instance, I will be performing the surgery myself. Let's begin with first learning the GUI. These following options are sections, essentially the main menu for each tool. Once you click on one of the sections, the medical instruments appear on your left side. To begin any medical procedure, Make sure you have the right amount of tools. Now that we are prepared, let's find a patient. Just a reminder that in the description, I will have all the notes from this lesson. Begin with opening the GUI. You need to be quick, under circulation, apply a tourniquet. Now you will be performing oxygen therapy. Under airway, place endotracheal tube within your patient. After, click breathing and place anode to tank. You will now be reviving the patient. Under resuscitation, you will begin chest compressions. If chest compressions do not work, it is time to use the defibrillator. Your patient is now stabilizing to keep them alive. You need to be fast. Insert an IV starter kit under medicine and split. It is now time to perform surgery. In my notes, the correct order is more organized. If you are the main medic, you will begin with the scalpel. Main medic will suction. Your partner or trainer will clamp. Now, main medic will begin to use 5 to 0 proline. Trainer or assistant will now use 4 to 0 nylon. Main medic will now use the scalpel again. After the main medic uses the scalpel, begin suction. Assistant trainer will now be inserting the catheter. After the catheter is inserted, begin using the balloon. Now, click the catheter again. Now to close up the patient by using for 2-0 nylon. Now go under circulation and remove the tourniquet. You will begin to start healing everything else. Use the basic medical procedures as if you were healing yourself or someone else. If you do not know how to heal using basic aid, please watch the video on basic medical care first. After complete healing, we will begin our conclusion. First, under breathing, remove the two tanks. Then, under airway, remove the endotracheal tube. Now, push epinephrine, which will be under medicine and splint. Your patient is now conscious. You may remove the IV starter kit. In conclusion, as long as you follow the same procedure and always have your notes with you, you will pass your advanced medical exam.